Hello. Hello. Uh, my name is Muhammad Khatib. I'm a um, Palestinian from Hebron. I'm 25 years old and I uh, currently work uh, here in Ramallah in the West Bank uh, as a fitness instructor and a yoga teacher. Um, we had the visit and we were honored uh, to have a visit from several teachers uh, from Give Back Yoga Foundation and uh, and I personally uh, was honored as well to to learn some practices of mindful yoga therapy uh, from a wonderful teacher called Suzanne. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, and the practices that I learned and the teachings that I learned uh, could be could help so much in in Palestine as I see it. Um, it could bring so much healing. It could heal so much of the wound that has been open for the past decades and decades and uh, I could totally see how it, it helps. Uh, it pers and it, for me personally, I, I've been practicing them only for a week or less than a week, but I've been seeing a lot of progress with myself, uh, seeing the light within me and reaching that inner peace. Um, and I could totally see how teaching this to others, uh, to, to the other Palestinians, who were wounded, whether spiritually, emotionally, or physically. Uh, how could this really heal it? And by healing the individuals, we could really heal the land and uh, reach peace. Because really, uh, outside peace is nothing without inner peace. And by reaching that inner peace, we could reach outside peace. So, um, and also on a personal level, I, I see it, it, it helps me a lot um, with getting the focus and, uh, and also uh, to, to use it in my own personal goals. Uh, and one of them is hopefully, uh, there is no wood to knock on, <laughs> but hopefully to, to make it to the Olympics in 2016 and represent Palestine and even win the Olympics. Uh, I know it's a very big goal, but uh, um, I mean, I mean it's, at least I dream and I try to do it, achieve it with every breath that I take. <laughs> uh, and hopefully my plan even after uh, reaching the Olympics is not, I don't do it for myself, I do it for others mainly, to, to bring back hope for a lot of Palestinians that have lost hope. And, and hopefully by that um, I can become an idol a humble idol for so many Palestinians and I could use all the techniques that I learned and that I will learn in the future to, to heal, to heal the Palestinians everywhere, whether in the West Bank or Gaza or outside or inside and then humanity, hopefully. <laughs>